Good morning, friends. It's Mrs. Virial with your morning announcements. Today is Thursday, March 23rd, 2023. Today is a C day for specials. On uh, our lunch choices uh, list today, we have grilled cheese with a tomato soup. We have a taco salad, and we also have the pretzel, yogurt, and cheese fun lunch. I have cheese sticks listed for our snack today. On Friday, we're slated to have beef tacos with refried beans, popcorn chicken salad, and the peanut butter and jelly uncrustable fun lunch. All right. I have some birthdays to announce. I have two, in fact. The first one is Mr. Reef Garrison in second grade. Happy birthday. I said his name totally wrong. His name is Garrison Reef. And happy birthday, Garrison. I am really sorry that I got your name confused today. And our second birthday is Ava Schulke. Ava's in first grade. Happy birthday, Ava. I hope you have a great day as well. Don't forget to come down and get your birthday um, bookmark and your birthday card. All right. So excited to have birthdays. All right. Don't forget today is our author visit. I think we're due down into the gym at nine o'clock to have a Zoom meeting with our author to share with her or she'll share with us um, how she writes her stories. She'll share one of her books that she's written um, and talk to us about what it's like to be an author and be a writer and be someone who creates um, tools for you and I to enjoy and love. All right, habit four, before I do anything else, let's do a quick reminder. And um, I thought this one was kind of interesting before spring break, so you can think about it. It says, a reminder about thinking win-win is to think about the golden rule. Ask another person what it means, and once you know, try it out on someone. And I always think of the golden rule as do unto others as you would wish them to do unto you. So if I want people to smile at me, I want to smile at them. If I want people to say good morning to me, I say good morning to them. If I want people to treat me kindly, I treat them kindly. So think about the golden rule, especially over break and thinking win-win and how you guys can all work together. Your family, yourself, your friends. All right. So... We have, I have a riddle and then I have a joke. So the joke is, why was the family so tired after returning from spring break? Well, of course they were tired because they had to fly all the way home. (laughs) Kind of joke. And then here's a riddle. I don't know if you've done riddles in a while, but I can be put in a bag. I'm not a sandwich. I have odor. Oh, excuse me. I have a door, but I'm not a car. I'm sometimes made of canvas, but I am not a piece of art. I have people sleeping in me, but I am not a hotel. What am I? Hmm. Thinking? Well, it's a tent. A tent can be put in a bag. A tent has a door, but it's not a car. It has um, a place for people to sleep, and it's made out of canvas. That's kind of a fun riddle. All right, don't forget Friday fun sales. This week include our gum. I have the um, extra gum and then the Hubba Bubba uh, strawberry watermelon and the regular watermelon. All right, tomorrow I do want to talk a little bit about, and I'll have to talk more in the morning, but we are going to make some s'more um, like treats before you go read around the building. So I'm super excited about that have all the materials. They're all ready to go. We just have to get them out and get you down here and make your treat. Um, The treat's going to have graham crackers, marshmallows, and mini chocolate chips. All right, here we go. For our first item, we have the axe that you're going to chop your firewood with when you're camping. Then I have my fishing pole. hope these are showing up because, again, I'm having that weird screen where I don't see myself. The map. I think we've had the map almost every single week. Oh, an old favorite, a pine cone. Lots of fun with that. The guitar for a little music around the campfire. Ah, the owl. Fun owl. The um, marshmallow on a stick, getting ready to cook over the campfire, I'm guessing. And then I have the water bottle where you bring your water while you're camping and take your bottles back out with you so you leave no trace that you were out there camping. All right, good luck with that. Let me just check my notes, make sure I've kind of talked about everything. We did bingo, we did gum, we did s'mores, we did our habit, we did our riddle, our author visit, which I'm super excited about. 
So now it's time for me to say, look to your teacher and decide how and when you'll do the Pledge of Allegiance. And remember here at Clay Girl Elementary, we are super leaders and super readers who are kind and generous to one another. Have a good day. Can't wait to see you.